We Predacons forbid you to watch this video if you are under the age of 13. That means you must click the box and exit the video. Yes. But if you continue to watch, it shall avail you not. No. For now the power gauntlet has been cast. Predacons terrorize! Hey everyone, welcome back to Input. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys a very simple upgrade that I designed and printed myself and made myself for Titan's Return Full Tilt. Now, to get this figure, you have to have a Trypticon, you have to get Trypticon, or just buy Full Tilt by himself off of eBay. Now, as amazing of a figure as this is, the one thing that's always bothered me about the figure is that his thighs were always hollow. Well, not anymore. So I designed and printed a kit. I've printed off a bunch of these thigh fillers and I because I figured I wasn't the only one kind of feeling that pain of full tilt needs some kind of thigh filler, right? Um, so basically what I did was is the thigh filler is basically for the top part of the thigh um, and it just kind of it doesn't fill in this gap right here uh, but the, that gap is where you know the joint the knee joint so I kind of stayed away from that I just wanted to fill the top part of this uh, and he's still fully transformable as well and so as you can see right here there's no paint rub fully transformable so we got his car mode right there and boom no paint rub none at all uh, now I did try to color match uh, as best I could to full tilt uh, I will be going back and you know repainting this and trying to match the purple even better um, but yeah uh, it's just something that I designed and, and whipped up and I am currently selling so if you guys want um, if you guys want a set of these hit me up on Instagram I have them up on eBay but eBay will only let me post one at a time I can't do a quantity amount that's for sale um, they the upgrade kit is relatively small this is it right here I only painted the outside of it so whoever you know if you guys want some you guys know what part is supposed to go on the outside of the of the thigh because uh, it can go in a bunch of different ways about three different ways it can go in but this is the way it's supposed to go in to get full coverage of to fill in that gap as much as possible it's just supposed to slide in like that uh, it is a relatively snug fit it is fully reversible though uh, but no glue needed at all it's all held in with friction and it is a very tight fit in there. Well, not very. It's it's snug, like I said. But it is fully reversible if you guys want to take them out. They are 3D printed on a resin printer. So you're not going to see a whole lot of print lines or anything like that. Like you typically see on a 3D printer. Uh, as you can see right here. Like I said, it is fully printed on... Fully resin printed... So not a whole no there's no print lines at all with 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 this print. So um and I think that's the added bonus of using the resin over your typical 3D printer. Uh now um now bigger prints on resin printers you will see the print lines if you look close enough, but smaller prints like this hide the print lines extremely well. So these are the print lines are pretty much invisible on these but yeah like I said if you guys want to set hit me up on Instagram uh, I do have them on eBay uh, eBay uh, like I said only allows me to post one one at a time so if you guys see one uh, or if you guys want one I should say just hit me up on Instagram my Instagram link is down below in the description so yeah uh, just thought I'd share you with you guys and if, uh, if any Body wanted one, uh, wanted a kit. Uh, show you guys what I designed, and if you guys, anybody out there wanted one, you guys be able to get one. So, as always, I'll see you guys next video. Be safe, love you guys, uh, and as always, cut it out.